Welcome to our whiteboard session for this week. Insert appropriate day now. We're not quite sure when it's going to be, but it'll be sometime this week. So well, this week we're talking about The Big Kahuna. Now this of course was a book that we wrote uh, back in uh, 2010, Susan and, and Gareth wrote, uh, and it really covered a lot of the issues that we've been talking about in recent weeks. And, brought them all together in one package. So the idea was that we could scrap the current welfare and uh, tax system and replace it with an unconditional basic income, a comprehensive tax on capital income, and a flat tax. So between those three things, we could transform our welfare and tax system and create a system which had huge benefits uh, for our economy and all New Zealanders. Let's have a look at some of those benefits. First up, a better economy. Well, as we've seen in past weeks, a unconditional basic income plus a flat tax makes sure that everyone has an incentive to work. There's never any poverty traps, there's never anything getting in the way of people working. So there's always an incentive for, for people to get ahead. And that is a real fundamental for a capitalist economy. So we'll end up with a, a better economy there. Also, the comprehensive tax on capital income, well that'll push our investments to productive sector, away from housing and from lifestyle businesses, to more towards productive businesses that actually generate income and wealth. So that, again, will improve our economy. What about everyone paying their share? Well, as we've seen again in previous whiteboard sessions, around about half of the top 200 wealthiest Kiwis don't actually pay the top rate of income tax. And that's because we don't have a tax on income from capital, so they have an incentive to put their income into capital which doesn't create cash income. So with a comprehensive capital income tax, we'll make sure we capture all of the income uh, that comes from having a pool of assets. And of course, a flat tax rate. Both of those things are much harder to avoid, so everyone will pay their share. It recognises unpaid work. Through an uncondi unconditional basic income, we recognise all of the voluntary work that's going out there, all the work from, from mothers, uh, all the work by, by students, by carers, by people doing voluntary work in the community. All of those uh, aspects are captured by an unconditional basic income because we don't have any criteria around who will receive that income. That is received by right. So there's no stigma and everyone can have a, a dignified life. It treats everyone the same. So we don't have this complex welfare and tax system that we have now which treats people differently depending on how old they are, whether they're in a relationship, who they live with, where they live with, all of that stuff is gone. The government shouldn't judge us on all that stuff, shouldn't make judgments on our private personal lives. It just makes sure we get enough basic income to get by and that we all pay our fair share. So beyond that, everyone should be treated the same. And finally, the big part of the big kahuna, the, the real benefit of this thing, is the whole simpler, simple, uh, the, the whole system blah, 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 is a whole lot simpler. If you can hear me over that ambulance that's going past right now, welcome to Wellington, the crime capital of New Zealand. Uh, <laughs> clearly, uh, it's a whole lot simpler and we can get rid of a whole lot of bureaucracy that, that runs our, our tax and our benefit system and we can uh, even get rid of a whole lot of accountants that are out there having to work out complicated ways for people to minimise the amount of tax they pay at the moment. And of course, think of all those voluntary groups that currently help people negotiate how to get through the benefit system and get the, the complicated benefits that they deserve. They could actually work on helping people. Wouldn't that be amazing? So that, folks, is the big kahuna. Why it works so well, turning our tax and welfare system on its head and treating Kiwis with dignity. Next week, in next whiteboard session, we will look at actually how the numbers stack up on this sort of thing. Why we can actually afford to do this in New Zealand today. <laughs>